The verdict has just been handed down. The judge has pronounced all four suspects guilty, but the sentencing will be issued in the next few days, likely tomorrow. They're saying September 11th. We're hearing the judge has not given any reasons for the judgment at the moment. That will also happen tomorrow. Now, the suspects were taken in the, into the courtroom a little while ago, maybe about 15 minutes ago, and there are heavy security. The parents were also escorted by the police to a separate entrance to presumably avoid the hundreds of journalists who are waiting here outside the courtroom. But we spoke to them earlier on the phone as they were heading to the court, and they said they want nothing less than a death sentence. For these suspects. Now, capital punishment is very rarely given in India, so we'll have to see what the judge decides. Uh, so tomorrow we'll have a clear idea what that sentencing may be, George. And, and Sunuma, the government actually changed the law after this attack because it was so brutal it, and it caused such outrage that now the death penalty is an option for the court. As you say, it is often uh, reserved for the rarest of rare crimes, they say, in India. Rarely used in India, but given the outrage across the country, uh, it does seem likely that these four men will, in fact, or at least some of them, will be receiving the death penalty? That's correct. That is the expectation right now, and that is certainly the hope as well. As I said, the parents have been demanding nothing less than the death sentence, and that's what a lot of these protesters who came out uh, months ago for weeks uh, also were demanding the death sentence. Of course, these four suspects have also been charged not just for rape, but also murder. The victim died two weeks later after that deadly gang rape, and uh, under Indian law, anyone charged of murder can be uh, convicted and sentenced. Uh, to, uh, uh, to life imprisonment and also the death penalty. So this is uh, not unusual in India, but at the same time, uh, the death sentence is rarely given in such cases, but because of the huge amount of public attention and pressure on the government, there is an expectation that that will happen. And, and Sunima, our affiliate there in India, CNN, IVN reporting uh, guilty of rape, murder, and also kidnapping. That's correct. Those are the, uh, they have been uh, charged under all of those charges, so they've been, uh, they have been declared guilty under all of those charges. We're still waiting for their details. They're not allowed inside the courtroom. There are a, a few pool reporters, foreign journalists inside, so we're still waiting for the details. But that's why we believe, uh, we've been told outside the courtroom that they have been charged under all those charges.